You look like you're a brave man. Yes, how are you? Guess what I do? $10 to play. How what you do you do, sir? You want to guess what I do for a living? I'm the naked cowboy. I'm going to guess what he do. <laughs> I'm going to say he uh, uh, comes up with a few scenarios or two. <laughs> what do you do? Oh no, that big time wrestler. All right, go ahead and read it. What does it say? I'm the naked cowboy. My buddy talks away pain. He's a motivational speaker. No pain, no gain. <laughs> Don't be a. <laughs> Don't be a. <laughs> okay, next one. You're gonna get ten bucks if you get it right, brother. Well, I would have been George Washington's best friend. That means he's supporting Trump all day because he wants to make America great again. <laughs> I like that one. That's a good one. Is that right? <laughs> That's good. I'm not, that right? I'm not a Trump. Well, uh, well, we'll work on it. Go ahead, take your shirt off while I'm singing. Okay. Trump's going to take those regulations off the backs of those we'll corporations. It sounds like a good idea to me. Hey, go read that one. I give people confidence. I get them off the fence. I'm a motivational speaker. I'm a I'm a life coach, and I. What do you do? Well, oh, no. it's time for that. It's biblical. What can <laughs> wash away my sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. What? Oh, he's a a love a marriage counselor. <laughs> marriage no. counselor. <laughs> no, no. I thought you were gonna get this. I thought. Wow. Well, no one got this far. I wouldn't get it by now. Love. I'm, I'm guessing good, aren't I? All right, let's do one more. I save people's faces. I'm the naked cowboy dealing with my favorite plastic surgeon. He does the surgeries that makes people grin. Plastic wow. surgeon. God damn. <laughs> well, why didn't you wear 40 shirts? I mean, you're really wasting my time here. <laughs> hey, can you hear it, brother? People joy. Boy. People cry for joy all the time around me Cause I follow the Lord Jesus and his jubilee Preacher? Are you saying? Are you preaching? I'm an ordained minister But I only do weddings and take confessions if they're good <laughs> Alright He's a badass mofo, he changes his life every day He's already made my day better And that's all I can say <laughs> <laughs> this one you gotta get. I'm the naked cowboy and I give out free hugs. The last guy who did that here, he's still living in the jug. He punched somebody in the face. <laughs> you make people smile? How do I do it? How do you do it? Yeah. You smile at them first. Okay, that's good. Psychology, I mean, what what's you reflect? What's you gotta you get on this one. Dental implantologist, you fix teeth? Now I'm a dental implantologist, I wish you met my wife. She's from Mexico, her teeth are crooked, and well, that's crazy. Now that I know this guy. <laughs> get your teeth fixed today, dental implants, from my good friend. What's your name? Brian Andrews, my friend. Brian Dude, you're good. Thank you. Really well, good. Do you have any questions about dental implants? Well, I just... Like everything else in my life, it all runs perfect, but that's psychology. My teeth Pretty are perfect. Good. I have the same 12 teeth I had since I was a kid. You're very blessed, man. No, I have like, I think 24, 12 and 12. They look good. You did a good job. Nice, man. My doctor, my dental, I was, my father was a fireman, and a guy on the fire department, Dr. Fear. Fear. Dr. Fear. Fear. my dentist. I swear to God, when he took out my molars, he had his foot on my forehead pulling him out. Like, he was tough. Are you but kidding he said, me? He always said I had good teeth. The root, everything was, you know, with the X-rays, they looked great. He said, if anything, maybe I'd have a problem with gums, but my teeth look great. So this is what we do every day. These kind of pictures, man. So we don't—we're not just regular dentists. We like basically we change people's lives. Of course. I look, mean, at, look at the difference in this mouth, right? My brother-in-law so, right now lives with me, and he's got like a couple cavities, and he kind of had bad teeth, eats a lot of sugar. And I'm like. Why wouldn't you fix that tooth before it falls out? Why? Well, I mean, I'm never saying you're, how you appear is yeah. pretty important. It's true. That's what I'm saying. But I love him to death. He's all his teeth could fall out. I still love him, but I'm just saying, I think it makes an impact. 
Well, naked cowboy man, you're the man. I love it. You got to get in, brother. Good luck. Appreciate you, man.